Hi, John from the RJG UK team here again. In previous videos, I've covered the benefits of sensor technology using process monitoring and quality control, and then how templates can be used to monitor around your ideal safe process. In this video, I want to talk about what I believe is currently a huge untapped potential of sensor technology, process control with cavity pressure and valve fit control. Both of these functions involve the RJG system outputting signals which the injection modern machine receives to actually take control of the process in some way. When we're talking about changing the process from an external device, let's have a disclaimer here. It isn't guaranteed to work on every part or tool design, and so it's important that we take extra care in safeguards and to ensure adequate training to be able to do it correctly. If it was my production facility at stake, I'd be using this benefit all day long, wherever I could. Why? Because cavity pressure changeover from fill to hold is the only way to prevent faulty parts being really made and allow worry-free lights out manufacturing with minimal quality inspection. So how does it work? Well, we use a modified process, which is we call a D3 process, but the crux of it is that cavity pressure sensors reach a certain value which corresponds with the correct fill level for the parts. This sends a signal to the machine to transfer to holding phase. Now, when I was first setting up a cavity pressure changeover at work, after letting the machine run for a while, I noticed that the process all of a sudden was going haywire. Injection pressure was varying wildly as well as the changeover point. Now, in my traditional molding mentality, I looked at the production, expecting to see faulty parts there, but I was surprised to see every part perfectly formed. The machine was just doing as it was told, waiting for our system to tell it to change the hold at the set cavity pressure value. Turned out, in that case, the nozzle was intermittently freezing off, causing the process instability. So I won't want to continue running it that way, so monitoring is still important. It was important to know that no bad parts were made during that instability, which amazed me at the time. Signals can also be sent from RJG systems to initiate sequential valve gate opening from pressure or temperature sensors, registering plastic passing over them, which minimises weld lines in large multi-gated parts, for instance. So imagine this. Because we can connect to our systems remotely, we can effectively now change our processes from home to correct defects. So you never need to miss your favourite TV show again. But seriously, with the RJG EDOT or Copilot taking care of the part repeatability, then staff can concentrate on more productive and creative work. Nobody wants to spend every day firefighting and constantly tweaking the process to account for the viscosity changes in the material, for example. Automate it where you can. To me, that's a no-brainer. So call us to discover whether you can achieve zero defects or remote control of your processes using our systems. Thanks again for watching. Thank you.